It's early January 2021. It's my last weekend out for grouse. I'm also looking for other small game and power scouting a property that I haven't checked out before. Stick around on this outdoor adventure. My name is Dan and welcome to DC Outdoors. If this is your first time here and you like outdoor adventure videos, gear reviews and other outdoor related stuff, we'll get started by clicking subscribe and the bell or notification button so you don't miss anything. Let's get hunting. It's January 9th, 2021. It's minus 11 degrees Celsius or about 12 degrees Fahrenheit according to my truck. I'm out solo hunting. My plan is to push back and explore some parts of this foot access property that I haven't been on before. I'm hoping to scout for big game for next year, and I'm hoping to find some grouse or rabbit along the way. What a beautiful, clear winter morning. I listen to the chickadees and I'm optimistic that I'll see some animals out enjoying the sun. So I've been bushwhacking around back in a spot on this property that I haven't checked out before and uh, just following a ridge to kind of look for areas that give me a bit of elevation if I decide to hunt here next fall and right over in there I saw a white-tailed deer looked like maybe a doe and she kind of went back in behind those trees didn't get the camera on her but I'm gonna take a look Keep following this ridge and uh, yeah we'll see if we can find her again look at the deer sign back here heavily used trails scrapes and antler rubs everywhere i'm very optimistic about this location for hunting next fall I follow the fence lines and I investigate down trees, willows, and grassy patches for rabbits. They burrow under this cover out of sight. Alright, took a walk through these little sluey willows and I didn't scare anything up. So I'm going to go try to head back through these pines. See if the grouse maybe went over that way. First rabbit, pretty excited about this. I was just walking around where I saw lots of sign and um, stomping on brush piles and this little guy popped out. So that technique definitely seems to work. Um, super excited and thankful um, for this rabbit. Got her all dressed and ready to keep on looking for more.
been a pretty great day so far. I was super excited to get that rabbit, uh, I guess hair technically. So really excited to get the hair, uh, field dressed it, tied it up to the backpack, continue to push through the woods. And uh, then I saw those moose. One looked like a little bull, which was awesome. And I'm assuming that the other was a cow. I watched them for a little bit um, and then tried to leave them alone and uh, been just kind of hunting my way through the woods. Main plan of attack today is just stomping out um, little dead clumps of willows. It feels like um, the rabbits and the hares are hiding under those clumps of dead willows and by stomping on them basically able to spook them out or spook them out of other ones that are nearby the one that you're stomping on so that's what I've been doing today and that's how I got lucky with that hair this morning um, it's warming up fairly well I guess it's about 130 right now and it's about minus two degrees Celsius it's a pretty nice winter day um, can't beat it it's been good to see some moose saw a deer got the hair heard a grouse uh, all in all, so far pretty successful. So I'm going to continue to um, hunt this tree line, um, kind of bobbing in and out looking for those little dead willow clumps. And uh, yeah, it'd be wicked to get another hare, another rabbit, or uh, a grouse would be awesome as well. So stick around. Well, that was a great day out in the woods. Thanks so much for coming along with me on this outdoor adventure. It was awesome to see some moose, a deer, and I even got a rabbit, I got a hare. Can't beat it, uh, what a great day out here. If you like hunting videos, you'll definitely wanna check out this video. And if you like outdoor adventure videos, gear reviews, and other outdoor related stuff, well, please click the subscribe button and the bell notification button so that you don't miss anything. Until next time, We'll see you outdoors.